This is my loving friend, the tree in the wood. We became good friends a few years ago. I was walking through the wood and communing with Mother Nature. And I stood by this tree and put my hand on it and it spoke to me. It was the second time ever in my life that I actually heard the voice of the spirit of the tree. He is one of my best friends, very wise, have given me loads of guidance through life. And I have to say, I absolutely love and adore him. If you have a friend as well in nature, all of the many beings in nature, they're all alive. They all can communicate. They can be your friends, just like any person or animal. All living beings have the capacity to communicate. This is the power of Mother Nature. This is the power of the divine womb of creation. This is the power in real action of the divine feminine. All beings create because all beings are related to one another. It's a bonding process. It's about relationships. And one of the main things about relationships is to be able to communicate, to talk to each other, to exchange what is good for one another and beneficial. So if you're next time you take a wood, a walk out into the wood, stop and look at a flower, look at a tree, speak to the river, speak to the earth, speak to the animals. Just listen with your heart, be open, and you will hear them speak to you. Send them love and thank them, like you would thank anybody else that you meet. You'll be surprised how abundant of beings we are surrounded with and how eager everything is to love and to connect and to communicate. This is the ancient wisdom of the wise ones. This is the wisdom of Mother Earth. Enjoy the springtime, a time of recycle and new birth, and enjoy all the wonderful things that all natural beings have to say and to give to you. Next time, we will look a little bit closer at all the wonderful things each being have to contribute to the beneficial of you and for others.